It's time for trivia. Now, my Jake, Jake, my trivia question yeah. is basically Derek Dietrich got invited to Yankees camp. Yes. Do we not have a Slack channel for this show? No. No. All right. Fuck. I'm just going to send it to BBD then. Uh, okay. So you have sent it to me. Derek Dietrich. Yeah. Got invited to Yankee spring training under the radar. No one had any uh, thought. He's a lefty that matches righties. The Yankees have forever wanted a lefty. I was just doing research for my own brain to have on this situation. Uh, Didn't think I would be going public with it anywhere. Mm. But then I was like, you know what? I'll turn this into my trivia question. It's very nuanced and it doesn't matter at all. You ready? Yes. Okay. Derek Dietrich, Jake. Yes. From you tell me when you want me to put it on the screen for the people. Yeah, after he guesses, I would say. Um, f- or the question, if you have the question, you can do it now. From 2017 to 2019, Derek Dietrich hit 48 home runs in 397 games. These numbers don't really matter, but okay. he hit 48 home runs in 397 games. A home run every 8.2 games. Three years, 48 home runs. On pace for 20 home run season, 19 home run season. I was looking up if he had played all his games during this stretch at Yankee Stadium, how many more home Mm. runs would he have had in those 397 games? First thing I did with Jay Bruce. So he was playing two of those years, um, 17 and 18. He was in uh, Miami, which is a big ballpark. Right. Then he went to Cincinnati. So how many do you think he would have had? He had 48. How many more do you think he would have had? If he played all his games at Yankee Stadium in that stretch where he was hitting home runs. Interesting. So, um, my initial thought process is that I like the question. Good job, Jim. It was more for my personal interest. I was just looking this up. I think the number will be significant, but the part that's holding me back is that a significant amount of homers means a lot of different things to a lot of different people. I mean, five different... If it's five more home runs, that changes the outlook of a career. I mean, six would be two more home home runs a season. If you start getting into a 12 range, I mean, you're talking about... What's the math on that? Four home runs a year? Yeah, four, times, four times three? Yeah. Uh, math pod, all of a sudden. Um With that being said, I do think it's an impactful number. I think he has real power, and I think Yankee Stadium, you know, can be a loophole in these kind of questions because it also doesn't necessarily translate it so facto. Final guess is 10. The answer to the question is 12. Okay. Which I'm glad your reasoning, I have it up here for you, I'm glad your reasoning said this. That is an impactful number. Yeah. That changes his pace from a 19 home run a season pace to a 26 home run a season pace. So you're pr- prorating it. Yeah. Okay. We, me yeah, and yeah, BBD yeah. did a lot of math together. Gotcha. We were doing it, then dividing so one the numbers two. that would change how much he would get in the right. 162. Yeah. Um, you know, there's a couple doubles here. These two on the fence, who knows? But I gave yeah. it to him. So no. maybe 10 is the right answer right. if I didn't count those. Listen, I don't think Derek Dietrich is like, you know, sign him up to put him on the Yankees now because of this. I was just interested in this information. And then I was surprised that in three seasons, if he was at smaller bar parks, yeah. 12 home runs, like Boy, you said, big parks. that's a lot to add on your season total. Yeah. Getting I'm, to the 4-5 range. I mean, it, it really opened my eyes. I mean, everyone's talked about it with lefties forever in Yankee Stadium, but Didi was the one that, like, you know, if you did Didi Gregorius, if he played his games at Fenway, which I don't know if you want to do that. Yeah, I will do. I can do that. I can do that. No, I can do it right now. In Didi's peak with the Yankees, he was only pulling home runs. The stadium helped him. Um, they, you know what? Like Didi Gregorius at, at Fenway Park might have been like an eleven home run guy. Um, we'll find out those numbers coming up. Coming up soon. That one's actually much easier to do because you just look at his home <laughs> runs. Whereas for <clears throat> um, for Dietrich, I had to look up you all to his look up doubles, the doubles and yeah, yeah, the outs yeah. that went 300 feet right. in the air. There was a lot of parameters. Where Didi just looking at his home runs from, I'm doing 2017 to 2019. 2017, 2019. This is his spray chart. Um, and now we go, first let's go to Yankee Stadium. They should all be mostly out. Yep. 
Now you wanted to go to Fenway? Yeah. And, I mean, that's a lot right there. I mean, yeah. Can you zoom in on that a little bit? I mean, where's the fence there? Right here. So one, two. I mean, all. That cluster, man. That's a good amount. Let me uh, let me take a screenshot of this. I wonder if he snuck a couple down the line there. That that, that would have been yeah. that would foul at the stadium, yeah. but wrap around the pole. Probably a few. Couple. Yeah. One or two. I'll, uh, was, uh, I'll, t- I'll slack like you this. like a playoff homer that went just foul. It might have been right before he hit the Grand Slam anyway against the Twins in 19. Mm-hmm. Here, BB. Oh, yeah, I'm slacking you this image. I don't remember if that was that at bat, but he yeah. had a, he had at least one like that that I do remember. You can show the people now. Yeah, image and root. Didi Gregorius is homer. Yeah, I don't. Is there a, is is Fenway the deepest right field? Uh, I think by technicality, yes. Yeah. No. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. that was Miami. Yeah. What's another big right field? San Francisco, or is that just right center? Nah, I mean, that's got right center because they got the wall <sighs> up. Yeah. That. No, I think it's Fenway. That fence shoots out. Was it the Mets when they, before they brought it in? You remember when they brought yeah. it in? Yeah. Maybe it was that deep. He loses a ton at Fenway. I mean, it turns into a completely different ball player. And I mean, maybe some of those are doubles if they're hard hit enough, but some are. But, but home runs numbers, I mean, yeah. I mean, we're probably looking and at 10 there. Yeah, there's a lot of balls over the were course like, of only the three seasons. Straight up, yeah. I think I think they get caught there. You don't think he's that? Oh yeah, I'm looking at the drives. screen now. That cluster is. It's a lot of balls yeah. right there. Cool.